A beautiful family with one face missing from this picture. I want to know that someone out there is seeing her picture or saying her name. This is Lila, a little girl, a daddy's girl with a bright smile. Eleven days, I think, after her first birthday, we got the official diagnosis. A devastating diagnosis for Kevin Levine's family. She had Tay-Sachs, which is a genetic disease where both parents have to be a carrier, and it's a neurological disorder. It's rare, it's destructive, and it is a cruel way to die. Kevin and his wife were carriers for Tay-Sachs disease. They didn't know until Lila's brain was already deteriorating, and she died just before turning three. It's a horrible way to watch uh, someone die, and it, it's a horrible way to suffer. That was 10 years ago. Very good. And since then, this middle school teacher in Dublin has found a new mission. A lot of people think, well, I don't have to get tested. It's not going to happen to me. Well, there are a lot of diseases out there that are very rare, but there are all sorts of risk groups for it that you may not even know your own family history and know if you're part of that risk group. Kevin wants young couples to get tested. Know if you're a carrier for certain genetic diseases and consider your options. Everything from simply knowing what you face to adoption and in vitro fertilization. You can't change your genes, but Dr. Dennis Bartholomew at Nationwide Children's Hospital says you can change your child's genes. It's an extraordinarily rapidly advancing technology that is very powerful. It's not inexpensive, but it represents the way that genetics is going towards trying to eliminate the frequency of these diseases. It's a message that has Kevin on a new path of running marathons. With each run, I'm trying to think of, okay, well, how do I get this message across even more? He is running for Lila. Kevin is going on his 10th marathon, raising money for Jewish family services and to encourage genetic testing because he'd never want anyone to face the pain he did. I'll say a prayer and, you know, she'll be in it. And so she's never far. Just leave, cause your presence